Come Friday, Jerry can't wait to enjoy his other passions. So in most respects, Jerry is like the rest of us. In one, he's just a little different. You see, Jerry is wheelchair bound. And that doesn't stop him from enjoying his two favorite outdoor activities, nature photography and hunting. This weekend is no different. We met up with Jerry at Fort Huachuca for a champ whitetail deer hunt. As always, scouting is the first thing on his agenda. Like the rest of us, he had a lot to do to get ready for this hunt. A quick call to the department. Customer service, how can I help you? And Jerry had all the information he needed to acquire his champ permit. Well, there's an application that has to be filled out for the champ permit. A portion champ stands for Challenged Hunter Access Mobility you, Permit. And a portion of the application is to be filled out by your family physician. To qualify, Persons with disabilities need to have an Arizona doctor's statement attesting to their mobility limitations. You can either come in and pick it up or we can mail it to you. Armed with the needed documents, Jerry's next trip is to the local game and fish office to get the permit. Hi, how can I help you today? I want to get a uh, combination license. Sunrise comes early on the fort, but that doesn't deter Jerry. At his chosen site before the sun rises, Jerry finds the ideal spot and pulls the truck off the road. The permit allows one thing that other hunters are not permitted. And basically what it lets you do is let you hunt from a motor vehicle. Uh, a motor vehicle that is not running, is off the, the main road. You know, you can't, uh, you can't drive the roads and then shoot out the window or something like that. But you can use your vehicle as a blind. So if you can set up kind of like we are here, you know, I can stay in the vehicle because I couldn't get around on all this rocky terrain and I can hunt from here, which gives me the ability to actually get someplace that I can hunt if I can get the vehicle there. Um, it also gives you the opportunity to use other kinds of motor vehicles, you know, like an ATV. Uh, you can actually hunt from a boat. As the light clears the horizon, Jerry and his helper, Tim Dalton, spot their first whitetail. Part of the CHAMP permit allows for a helper with a dispatch permit. The mission of ADSO is to take disabled uh, people out into the woods, uh, whether it be fishing, hunting, bird watching. I am a licensed guide, but basically I've tried to set up the business more as an assistant. Um, you know, let the, the hunter be the hunter, you know, actually experience the hunt, hunt doing everything himself. and. Uh, I'm there to help them with, you know, getting the animal, retrieving the animal, gutting it, and doing any of the field dressing. Well, that one's way out of range. <laughs> I waved as he went by. <laughs> Better luck next time. Hunters with disabilities have some specialty gear available to assist them in the field. I stay away from guns, you know, longer guns. That's you know, like when I bird hunt or, or anything like that, I shoot a side-by-side -side double because it's shorter than like a pump or a, a, an automatic or something like that because they're longer guns and that extra length, you know, makes it harder for me to set up. Uh, my rifle here, I finally settled on this one because it's shorter. Um, it's got a, I think it's an 18-inch barrel, maybe 20, but um, it's a lot shorter, so it, it works for me. But it's just what works. Um, most, most guys, if you shoot from a wheelchair or something, um, you'll probably end up with wanting some kind of a rest, you know. And there's all kinds of stuff you can mount on your wheelchair or something like this thing here that you just, you know, put it on the ground and you can you know, use it to hold your gun and stuff. Um, there's all different kinds. Uh, people that have um, higher level disabilities where they have less uh, finger dexterity and stuff like that, there's all kinds of, there's sip and puff triggers, you know, for guns so you can, you know, shoot your gun with your mouth as opposed to have to use your fingers. And, um, there's uh, um, a lot of, there's a lot of um, blind individuals that uh, shoot bow, go bow hunting in, gun hunting. They have offset scopes or offset sights on their, on their equipment and they have a partner that sights over their corner and tell, over their shoulder and tells them when to shoot. I mean, it's just whatever you need. And what we need to do is find another whitetail. With the sun well above the horizon, that's not likely to happen. So we pack up and do some more scouting.